STEM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering and Maths. And it's an area of the school that has been catered for within the curriculum, but beyond the curriculum we're wanting to experience um, a lot of different opportunities, so to offer a lot of different opportunities for the girls to um, be engaged in the sciences, to be engaged in technology, to be engaged in maths, be above and beyond what's expected for the HSC. This is definitely part of the Renaissance Woman. So a Renaissance Woman is a woman who is educated across a broad range of disciplines, uh, the creative arts, performing arts, the sciences, languages, cultural, global, and this is an opportunity for us to be able to focus on the sciences. We have the cars here because we want to experience and expose the girls to a, a side of life that they wouldn't normally or traditionally be exposed to. We invited a few cars to come in and we got rather a generous response. I'm surrounded by some amazing vehicles. We've had the uh, Ferrari Club of Australia come in. We've got the Aston Martin Club of Australia over there. And we've got a whole row of classic Jaguars dating back from 1950s. The main reason is that the Year 11 physics girls need to look at car safety. That's where it all came from. Um, they were looking at how um, how vehicles have changed over the last 70 or 80 years. Many of these girls, this will be the first time they've seen vintage cars, exclusive cars if you will. They're studying about motors, they're studying about improvements that have taken place in the cars um, over a period of time. And the best way for them to learn that and to experience is to witness it firsthand. So the oldest car we got here was built in 1927. Uh, the newest car we have here is a 2014 Jaguar F Sport, which is um, over the other side. And um, the, a really lovely thing about today is that the owners have been so very generous. The girls have actually been in and out of the cars for the last couple of hours and just to experience them looking under the bonnet but also sitting in them behind the wheel. And it's not every day you get to sit behind the wheel of a Ferrari. Lots of photographs, lots of sitting in the cars. I think some girls even bought their parents, a couple of dads wandering around having a look at it. It's been a wonderful opportunity for them to experience a side of, of life that they wouldn't normally see.